Okay, so one other thing I wanted to add. So I'm back up here as far as I can, but you see, I gotta take this roof piece off to continue here. But see, this is uh, I'm assuming this is silicon. Okay, and you can see right here, it did not adhere. Okay, and I noticed that was a problem. And I know any of you guys that have outdoor furnaces, you're gonna know what I'm talking about. You get to add water and you walk away from it for a second or you get to looking at your phone or whatever it might be and this thing overflows, the water comes down, gets underneath here because it didn't adhere to the metal, right? So it gets down underneath here, overflows, comes down, gets underneath here, goes down, your insulation gets wet. Not good, okay, because not, insulation not only... Uh, holds heat out or holds heat in, but it also holds moisture. And you think, well, you know, this thing's running, it's 100 million degrees or whatever, it's going to dry that out. Yeah, it will, but eventually it's going to rust. And once rust starts, it keeps going, keeps going, keeps going. At least that's been my experience. I'm only one man and I ain't a rock scientist. So, that's my disclaimer. Anyway, so I gotta work on getting all this stuff off. Oh, I did want to tell you guys one thing. So there's a company out there that makes a product. It's called Through the Roof. Through the Roof, okay? And it's a, it is not a silicon-based product, but it acts very much like silicon. The good thing about it is, it will adhere to things when it is wet, so it's great to use on roofs. And it has a, uh, oh, what's the word I'm looking for? Well, what it does, it, it will expand and contract, you know, like 50% or 40%, I forget what it is, but it will expand and con contract with the stuff that it adheres to, okay? Which, guess what's going back on here? Through the roof. It's a superior product. So, anyway, I'm done for now.